All right, so at this point you have um, timed all of your phrases correctly and you have um, added the correct karaoke to each of the phrases that you want to add them to. Um, like all the karaoke timing is set and all the phrase timing is set. At this point, uh, you want to make it a little bit fancier and um, here's how you do that. So you go to the top of the dialogue and you just insert a line before or after actually. That doesn't really matter where you insert it, but it's easier to keep track of here. So you insert it before. So this is going to be a special line of dialogue that's not actually a line of dialogue. So uh, you want to hit the uh, comment checkbox and then in the effect section, uh, you're going to want to type template line and um, once you do that then you want to insert the code that you're going to apply to the subtitles um, in this section in the actual dialogue section so I actually on the github let me just go over here so on the github I have a file called karaoke templates.txt and um, it basically has the, the code that you can paste here. Um, so this is the code that will make the words like appear as they are said, uh, like I have in the video that I uploaded. Um, and this will make it uh, so you have the whole line appear and then the word gets highlighted. So uh, I'm going to show you this one first. Um, so you get your code and you paste it in there. And um, if you'll notice, uh, in the text section, there's actually like a gear or a flower, some kind of icon appearing there. Uh, that's the indication that it's going to be a code line. So uh, once you have that set up, uh, you should be able to go into the automation section, and there should be uh, this should be available now. Apply karaoke template. So if you click that, uh, and then you go and look at where your um, subtitle karaoke subtitles are. Um, now they are working. Uh, so that's how you do that. Um, I can show you also. Okay, so once you do apply this, it's going to permanently alter the subtitle file. Uh, you still ha will have the karaoke timing, but it will all be commented out and it will be replaced by effects. So uh, you don't want to do this until after, for sure, you have uh, set all of your karaoke stuff. Um, and once you save it, it's going it, to... It's, like, it's not, like, impossible to undo, but it's, like, a process. You have to uncomment everything and delete some stuff, so it's, like, uh, but whatever. So I'm going to show you what the other subtitle looks like in case you want to use that. So I undid, I undid the change that I made, and now I'm going to redo it with this one. Animation, apply karaoke template, and... And that's pretty much all you have to do, and that's all you need to know really to make these subtitles. So I'm going to save this, and if I uh, go back here and I open a video, and then I go here and open the subtitle file, it should work. And that's basically how you do it. So, uh, yeah, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments of this video. Uh, thanks for watching.